final thoughts on the importance of embassies and primary schooling support? Uh, hey, everyone, can you hear me? Through that one. Okay. Today I'm going to talk about reinforcement learning of PAMDPs using a spectral method. Uh, this is joint work with my advisor, Anima Anand Kumar, and uh, Alessandro Lazaric. So uh, to explain a little bit what is the reinforcement learning, actually in the reinforcement learning we are trying to uh, study the agent and environment interaction. Here uh, I'm showing a cartoon here. Uh, at each time step, we assume that the environment is at some uh, configuration, we call it a state, which is like uh, hidden from the agent and agent choose some action and apply that action on the environment and the environment as a result of that action goes to new state which is again that one uh, is hidden from the agent as a result of this transition uh, the environment provides some reward for the agent and emits some observation and the agent just uh, has access to this observation so uh, the good thing about the about reinforcement learning is in reinforcement learning the agent receives this uh, data this is observation reward and the uh, action and with respect to this uh, uh, this information it tries to reinforce the policy the voice the policy is like a mapping from this history uh, to the action space in such a way that we can collect as much as possible uh, reward so again to go briefly uh, over this model at each time a step, the agent choose some action based on the uh, what's happened in the in the in the in, uh, in the previous time steps, and uh, based on this action, the environment provides some reward uh, for the for the agent, and uh, it goes to new. I mean, and the the, the environment pro provides some observation for the for agent. So, the good thing about reinforcement learning problem is in the reinforcement learning problem, we do not have any prior knowledge about the environment. So, we need to do something and explore the environment. And uh, based on this exploration, we, we learn something about the environment. And based on these learned things, um, we, do the, we exploit this, this, this information and do the planning. So, um, actually, to, go to, to learn these things and... Uh, uh, store these things. Uh, it's kind of not possible because it gro and grows like by time linear in time. So we try to model the environment uh, with some popular models. Uh, for example, one of the most popular model people use is MDP, is Markov uh, decision process, uh, which assumes like some Markovian assumption on, uh, for the state. And uh, it's the, this very strong assumption here is uh, fully observability of the environment, which means that the hidden state of the environment, which is exactly the uh, observation uh, provides for, for, for the agent. And we here in the MDP problem, we assume the Markovian assumption over the uh, state transition, which is uh, here the observation, and we can reduce this one to this uh, small pro uh, transition probability. And at each time, it's based on the current a state and current action, the environment provides some uh, reward for, for, for Asia. So this is a graphical model with respect to the MDP, and uh, we know that based on previous talk, we know that how to, uh, how to learn this model and how to uh, do the planning on this model, uh, which is based on the Bellman equation. So here we said that the Markovian assumption is really strong, and more or less we do not have this we cannot have this strong assumption in the real environment, so we uh, we are going to look at a little bit more complicated uh, model, which is partially observable Markov decision process, which is like this. At each time, as said, there are the uh, the environment is at some hidden state. We do not have access to that. The environment provides some uh, observation for us, and and at this time. The agent choose some action, and based on this action, when and this hidden state, we have the dynamic over hidden states, and we get we would get the re re reward. So, how about doing the reinforcement? We know that there are a lot of uh, algorithms to do the reinforcement learning based on MDP. So, how about we do the reinforcement learning based on uh, partially observable Markov decision process? So, if we try to solve the uh, Pomde problem. 
there are a lot of challenges. One is because there is a hidden structure f uh, in the model and the, the, the active dynamic is like hidden uh, and we do not have access to that. The learning part is hard first. And second, the planning for the, if you know the parameter of the model, parameter of the, parameter of the uh, palm DP model, even in that case, the planning is hard. It is uh, PS space complete. So what's our contribution? Our contribution in this paper is we brought novel uh, method to do the learning part of the palm diff model uh, based on uh, tensor decomposition methods and uh, we pr uh, introduced a new um, uh, UCRL upper confidence bound reinforcement learning method to do the trade-off between uh, um, exploration and exploitation and we said if we have access to Oracle to to solve the palm uh, to to give give us the the optimal policy we would get uh, the regret, which is like a s uh, order of a square root of t uh, for, the, for the memory memoryless uh, setting. So this is the algorithm we have. At, uh, at the beginning, we uh, initialize with some stochastic policy. We know that for, for uh, memoryless policy, the optimal policy is a stochastic policy. We initialize with some stochastic policy and apply this uh, stochastic policy to the environment. And we would receive uh, observation and we would apply this action based on this observation and we would get reward. And we do this and we apply this uh, policy until we, this is condition satisfied, at least for one action the number of sample is doubled. When the, the number of sample for action, at least for one action is doubled, we feed this information to, the, uh, to our uh, learner blo block which uh, apply the tensor method on the on this information and gives us some estimation of the prime DP, the parameter of the model, and the gives us the uncertainty. I mean, the confidence band over each parameter. And we now we have the set of possible palm DP model, and over them we choose the optimistic policy, and we go here and again in the next episode we apply this new policy and we collect the new data. And based on and whenever the number of sample at least for one action is doubled we feed this in new information to the learning block and based on this new information we come up with new uh, estimation and uh, like tighter, tighter, tighter bound over the parameter and we get over this, 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 uh, this procedure. So let's see how we do the uh, learning part. Uh, for to, to start with the learning section, let's, let's first talk about the uh, hidden Markov model. So in hidden, which is a simpler model, and the, the dynamic is not active here; is passive. We have underlying a Markov chain, and at each time step, the hidden state provides us some observation. And at uh, for the ne next time step, we go to the to the new state. We can show that given the middle state, we can have multi-view model. So here we have transition from one is to another state with the uh, probability distribution P, which is the pro uh, transition matrix, and we have emission, mat emission matrix, which is uh, the probability of observation given hidden uh, state. We can have this model based on this model, and uh, here the, dis the, the distribution over Y1, I mean the observation at this, at this node, given uh, X2, uh, which is we call it v1 and the distribution over y2 given x2 we, we call it v2 and for the third uh, view we can it's easy to see that the v2 is exactly o because condition x2 the y2 is o and for v3 it's uh, going from this state to this state and generating p is, is like o times p it's well studied and well, well understood that if we uh, form this moment and decompose it we can uh, uh, and doing some uh, simple uh, like uh, mathematical stuff, we, we can come up with this O and OP and after that uh, finding the ma transition matrix. So we are going to use the same idea to do uh, to, to, to learn the palm DP model. Uh, there are some conditions I forgot to say is like uh, to, to, to be able to learn the model we need to we need to satisfy 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 some some condition which is like v1 v2 and v3 should be conditionally independent given x2 
and uh, which trans which translate to the O matrix is full column rank and transition matrix is full, full column rank and hidden uh, Markov chain is uh, ergodic. So let's take a look at the uh, palm diffie model. In palm diffie model, we to come up with the new at each time a set to come up with the new action, we need all information from the from the past, right? So uh, to solve this problem, we actually first looking at the simpler one, which is memoryless policy, which says that each time a set that the distribution over action, uh, we can have the distribution over action just condition on the current observation. So let's let's uh, look at this graph model. So same as before, if we condition on this middle action and middle state, we would get this tree view, right? So we can see condition on these two blue uh, node, these three, these three um, view are, in, are condition independent. So we can apply it again the multi-view model and uh, tensor decomposition model to, re to estimate the model parameters. So these are the, the matrices, which is the pro uh, distribution of these three va uh, variable given these two uh, nodes. Okay, so now we know how to do the learning part. Let's talk about, uh, to do about the reinforcement learning. So the condition for palm DP to be learnable is uh, the O matrix should be full column rank and the slice of the transition matrix should be uh, full column rank. These are the conditions we have. And we show that if, if the number of sample is larger than some uh, order of x, the num x is the number of uh, hidden state. If the no number of hidden state is 12 over 4. If the number of sample is uh, larger than some order of x to the power of 4 times a, uh, then we can learn the model parameter with this uh, accuracy. Uh, which is goes uh, down with if we increase the number of samples, and this is the probability. This is the uh, transition matrix. The trans each fiber of transition tensor, and this is the each, each column of the uh, emission matrix, which which is like order optimal. So let's go uh, uh, again through the through, through the algorithm. At each time, at the beginning, we up, we have one uh, stochastic policy, and we applied memoryless and stochastic policy, and we apply this uh, policy on the environment, and we collect some samples, and based on these collected samples, we come, we estimate the new, mo new the parameter of the model, and based on these estimated param the parameters and the uh, un uncertainty, we come up with new policy, and for next episode, we apply this policy, and we stop when the number of samples, at least for one action, is doubled, and we collect this now amount of sample, and uh, based on this sample, we come up with new policy, and so on. And so this is uh, the, the 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 cartoon I borrowed from uh, my colleague. Uh, at at the beginning, we have we have some uh, samples. We come up with some. Let's say, is it visible? Uh, we come up with this new estimation, and at the new episode, at the next episode, we collect more samples. We come up with the tightest band for, uh, let's say we, we came up with this one, with this uh, node, and mm, this is the actual value, and this is the error, and we know that the confidence band is this circle, and that the next episode, we collect more samples, and we, we tight, we tight the, 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 the uh, uncertainty and our confidence band. So uh, let's Look at the regret. Uh, what is regret? Regret is like uh, how how good our algorithm works with respect to to the best policy. <coughs> uh, so this is the notion of a regret, which uh, the previous talks they talked about that. And um <coughs> let's define something like diameter of the palm DP, which is maximizing over pair of state and action, going to new state of the pair of state and action. And minimizing this fa this mean pa mean passing time going from the pair of state action to new pair of state action, and minimizing this uh, over the policy, we call it the diameter of the palm DP, and we show that the regret in this case uh, is as follow: it's uh, a, it's order optimal first, 
and it's uh, is uh, is the the rate is like a square root of t, and uh, it depends on the action diameter and the number of the y is the number of uh, uh, observation and x is the number of state. To make it more clear, let's let's compare it to mm, the, the to MDP model, which is uh, which is the work by Peter. And uh, in this model, they show that the regret for the uh, MDP model when the number the, when the the uh, state and action are equal. I mean, um, I mean, I mean here everything is observable. There is nothing like uh, non-observable. In this case, they define new. They define an, uh, another no notation of diameter, which is uh, mean passing time going from one state to another state. Uh, and you can see that these two bound are related to each other. And uh, the I mean, with respect to the time and di dimension, they are kind of related. And here. In this model, we assume that we the the thing we see is uh, is is whole observation, right? So, for some cases, uh, the number of possible observation might get larger than the number of hidden states. So, for example, in this case, uh, when the number of observ possible observation is like larger than x three, then this algorithm works better. Uh, I mean, the regret is like kind of better than MDP. So let's just go through some some uh, experiment we have done. We applied the, our algorithm on the real world uh, game. Let's let's assume we are we have this grid grid world game, and we have s some uh, sweet apple apples and uh, some poisons poisonous apple, and uh, the agent just has the. Uh, view of its this box, the box above of it. We applied our algorithm and come which the, in this case the agent just has like two, four possible actions. It can go uh, left, right, up and down. And it and the number of observations for the box here can be apple or uh, poisonous apple or nothing or or wall. We have wall here. And we choose the number of states equal three and we apply the algorithm uh, on this game and compare it to DQ and deep, uh, Q network with 10 by 10 by 10 uh, units and uh, this robust way of gradient descent. And we got this, this result. We, uh, the, the, the performance of our, algor our algorithm is much better than uh, DQN. And we made, we made the game more, a little bit more complicated. And we have like eight action. It can goes uh, the agent can goes uh, any direction, and we compare it again. Our algorithm works better, and we increase the number of observation to like 64 here. And uh, here again, we applied it, and the the improvement of DQN was like a fixed amount of improvement, but our but our was like more than that. Mm, I'm. You might be aware of the. Uh, tensor method, but I'm gonna skip this part and just go through the summary. So in this uh, work, we show that we show that uh, we we, we pr uh, propose new uh, method, novel uh, learning method for PalmDP, and we uh, prove the best um, regret bound for this problem. And uh, we showed that we, we propose a new uh, exploration and explo exploitation uh, trade-off for this. And uh, our goal in future is applying this method to the to larger games and get, and see what's gonna happen when we com compare it to DQN. Uh, and we are going to extend this uh, memoryless policy-based work to like limited one and or, or even the belief-based and. Uh, the, for the planning of a palm DP for in the memoryless setting, we know that this is uh, non-convex optimization. I'm going to talk about this problem tomorrow uh, in the open pr uh, problem session. Thank you.